Despite growing concerns from health officials as the country continues to lift restrictions, questions about vaccine passports still remain, including what are they and what they would be needed for. 23 ABC's Kylie Walker is joining us live in East Bakersfield and has more information on vaccine passports. Good evening, Kylie. Good evening, Alex. A vaccine passport is essentially asking for proof of a vaccine in order to go somewhere, such as flying on a plane or going to a concert. But with this, we have seen some pushback, which is why we caught up with a local attorney to find out if this could be legal and what this will look like in the near future. Is that businesses do reserve the right to refuse service, okay? They, however, cannot re refuse service on an illegal basis. Jay Rosenlieb says that it is legal for a business or entity to ask for proof of a COVID-19 vaccine or proof of a COVID negative test. But he says that asking the question doesn't end there. While a citizen's First Amendment rights would not protect them from this, Rosenlieb says that they should not be denied service with proper legal documentation. For example, if someone has a medical condition that prevents them from getting the COVID-19 vaccine. All businesses, all venues uh, have to um, provide reasonable accommodation. And if someone has some kind of a medical disability, they can't deny entry to that. And coming up tonight at 11, we will have more on these vaccine passports and if this could be a federal mandate in the near future. In Bakersfield, I'm Kylie Walker, 23BC, connecting you.